We are here at Colorado Media Day with senior defensive tackle Will Precheck. Will, uh, what's it feel like to not only be the veteran on the defense line, but the veteran of this entire team? You know, it's, it's a good feeling. Finally, you know, you put in all your dues, you've been through the ups and downs, and, and now, it's, now it's time to, you know, put it all together, let it shine, and, uh, you know, these, these younger guys are looking up to you, so it's, it's definitely a responsibility to you know, set the culture right and show them how it's done so they can follow in your footsteps. You mentioned the young guys, and, and you've got four uh, freshmen uh, in the interior of that defensive line. How much are you playing the role of mentor during camp here? I'm definitely playing the role of mentor. I'm, I mean, I'm trying to give them little words of wisdom, you know, what I've learned out through, through the years and, and kind of what to expect and, and, and whatnot and trying to help them, you know, lessen the learning curve as much as possible. When you think back to your freshman year, what was the hardest thing in terms of the transition from high school to this level of football? I'd say the hardest thing is, uh, you know, for me, I came in with no D-line experience. I got changed to D-line in the third day of camp. So kind of the hardest thing for me was just getting the technique down and also the speed of the game. The speed of the game is definitely so much faster in you know college level than at high school level. So kind of the speed of the game and getting your technique right is probably one of the hardest things. Now you were big when you came in. Uh, did you think you were, you were going to stay at tight end throughout your, the course of your career? You mentioned it was just three days in that you moved, but did you come in thinking you were going to be a tight end? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I came in initially thinking I was tight end, and then I gained about 20 20 pounds my freshman summer and uh, kind of saw the handwriting on the wall. I was either going to be a blocking tight end or get moved to D-line or O-line. Now it seems like you've made improvements every year. Do you feel like you've had kind of linear progress as a player throughout the course of your career here? Absolutely. You know, just kind of picking up the technique from freshman, sophomore, and then we got these new coaching staff in and, you know, they taught different techniques, so I kind of had to pick up on that. And so you know, right now I feel very comfortable with, with what I got to do and how to do it. And so now it's kind of just, you know, improving on the, the fundamentals and getting everything right. Uh, coach Black and the strength and conditioning coach told me uh, that he wanted to get a lot of guys to lose body fat to, you know, improve the overall team speed. Have you noticed a difference in that regard? Well, me personally, we kind of did a before and after picture. <laughs> it, was, it was pretty pretty impressive what, what I looked like. I knew I looked white and fat, and then afterwards I was kind of tan and, and definitely thinned down, and, and uh, it, was, it was very impressive what uh, Coach Black's done throughout the summer. Now, uh, l last year's senior group wanted to win that long losing streak. They were successful doing that. I hear all the seniors on this team, even though there's a very few of you, talk about bowl game being the, the goal. Is that pretty much what your focus has been on uh, this offseason going into the season? Absolutely. You know, that's our goal. we got to get to a bowl game. I haven't been there, and I've been here five years. So, you know, bowl game is, is what we're looking at, and, and we're going to get it. Is, has this incoming freshman class uh, injected uh, something into this program that's going to put it in uh, good standing for, for years to come? Oh, absolutely. I think I think you know, coaches got their their feet underneath them with recruiting and getting getting the type of players they want. And so I think you can definitely see you know the recruiting class is getting better and better. And so that's just going to put more and more pressure on everybody to compete and get better. And you know, in the end, that's going that's what you know a good program is. Josh Topu doesn't look like your typical freshman. I think he's about 325 pounds. Uh, what are just kind of your initial impressions uh, of him up there up front? Well, yeah, he looks like he's about 32 years old <laughs> and father of two, but uh, he's, he's big, strong, and, you know, he's a quick learner. And so that's, that's, that's a good thing for D-lineman, and uh, he's picking up well, and he's, he's, he's playing well. And behind you, linebacker, they've got some talent, some depth. Uh, uh, you know, how much of your job is to free those guys up, not to have, you know, blockers coming at them? You know, that's not my job. I, my job is to make plays myself, but if, I, if I'm doing my job as in trying to make plays, you know, they're going to have to double team me and stuff like that, which will keep them off the linebackers and, and then allow them to make plays too. So, you know, by doing my job, I do help them, you know, keep, keep the line off of them because they're more concerned about me. What's the camaraderie been like on the team this camp versus years past? You know, it's been, it's been good. You know, uh, everybody's really excited and, and getting everything kind of going and, uh, as far as the defensive side, you know, I like I like what what we what we have going uh, as far as you know, kind of like the dark side, and um, and you know we're 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 gonna do well. I feel like it sounds like the defense has done well uh, since you've put on the shoulder pads. Oh yeah, we've we've definitely definitely done well. But you know, the offense will always come back with some you know something new. So we got to be ready and always on our toes. Thanks, Will. Appreciate it.
Thanks.